What's up ninjas, it's Dee here, and today I'm gonna to show you how to add 3D glasses to your Vroid VTuber model. So of course, the first thing you wanna do is install Unity, which is a free program. We're gonna go ahead and just make a new thing. I'm just gonna name it glasses. All right, so it'll take a while for it to load, but when it finally does, it's gonna look like this. Now the next thing you're gonna to wanna to do is import the Unity package so you can open VRM files. like so just put it down in the assets it's going to load hit import now you're going to go up to vrm this to top toolbox and hit this one to import grab the file you're trying to import and just hit save into the unity folder doesn't matter where this goes now go ahead and hit that vrm file at the bottom Hit open prefat at the top, and this is the model that you brought in. Now, we're gonna add the glasses model. So you can get 3D models from most CAD sites for free. Just Google it. And I already found my glasses one, so I'm just gonna pull it in. So my file is an FBX file, which is just a 3D file. And there you go. I just drop it in down here. And first thing you want to do is make sure you rig it to the head. So you grab this thing and you take it down to the head. Now it's just going to pop itself into frame like so. And you want to just move it however you need to. Just go ahead and find it in the arc. And there you go. So this is it. You know, you just drop the file in and now you just have to place it you know, attached as close to the head without being in the head. This might take a couple of tries. Now just make sure it's not just like shoved in the head which is why you probably have to increase the scale a bit, which is the top button up here. The scaling, this rotating, it's pretty self-explanatory. Next, you want to recolor the lens to whatever fun color you want. Go down to materials, go ahead, create material. Go ahead and name it whatever you want. I totally misspelled that. It doesn't matter. I'm gonna pull that into the black part of it, like so. You can change how you want this to look. If you want it darker, you can see there's like a metallic option to make it more shiny or not. Totally up to you how you guys want to do it. But it's really cool, like the amount of options you have to like, I'm like gesturing to uh, customize it. So I also want to change the material for the lens because this is going to create a, um, a glare in VC face. So I'm going to pull it here and I'm going to change it to translucent, which is that, like so. So I went through that real fast, I didn't even think about it. So I went to VRM, I did Mtune, I changed it to transparent, and then I changed color mode to off. Then you're gonna go down to texture, and gonna go down to white, and just pull it to transparent. This is what the transparent is, it's just this bar, and that's it. So now, you know, it looks like glasses, but you can't actually see it. If you want to make it a little like, you know, showy to show that there's glasses or a lens, you can just change this opaqueness. Um, but VC face will sometimes read this as like this. I don't know why it does that, but it does. So sometimes I just don't, I don't add it. But I don't know, we're gonna try it. Let's see if it shows up after I export this. So to export, go ahead and hit the VRM name at the top of the hierarchy. VRM, hit the same folder and hit export. It's gonna ask you to input this information in order for it to actually export. Now where this new VRM file goes is actually the important part. So don't lose where you put this. Cool. So you can see it when I exported that there is a light like glare for the lens right there, but it's not too obvious. So this model looks great. And that's it. 
So I hope this tutorial is helpful. Feel free to comment below for what tutorial I should make next. Uh, this was a commission. So if you guys want to commission me to make your own VTuber and Vroid studios, feel free to message me on Discord. The link is below. And that is all. So I'll see you guys next time. Happy holidays. Bye. <laughs>